Hi friends, it's Auntie Cuckoo here. Welcome back everyone. I'm so excited. I have a few hours on my hand this evening and I'm headed into Ikea to take a look around. So I thought I'd invite you all to come with me. Let's go shopping. So I just walked in and they have out some really cute Easter chocolates. These are just like the ones I found at Cost Plus World Market. Way more affordable here at Ikea. Now they also have all of these battery operated candles. $1.99 on those individually. And then they do have packs of them. And those would work out great in their little lanterns. I love to take a look at these each season that I make it out this way and this year they have them out in silver and cream. I did find some beautiful glassware in this really pretty teal color. Great prices on those. I believe the set was $3.99 and then they do have the larger version for $4.99. I always love to look at the utensil section and this was something new. This is one of those ricers so you can take cauliflower, potato, things like that and make it into grains of rice. This is something I use daily in my home. It's just an extra large strainer and I love mine. Now this is what started me realizing that I was going to see a lot of farmhouse stuff. That strainer screams farmhouse in the white. They do have quite a few different colanders and strainers. This one I thought was really affordable for $6.99. It's one of those that sit in your sink and has the adjustable sides. I very deeply considered picking one up. Might have to do that next time. They also had the silicone version that is collapsible for $7.99. Really compact if you have a small space or maybe a little apartment. Fun kitchen gadgets all over the place. But now let's move in to their cutting boards they have so many great cutting boards you guys this is only $5.99 and it was large it has one little hole at the top if you wanted to hang it or hold on to it really really good deal this entire wall is just covered in cutting boards of different shapes and sizes and they were all so affordable now it looks like they had just put these out because a lot of them don't have their prices out yet that little version in the paddle styles $3.99 here's more of the larger version they have these in sort of an oval I think they look a little bit more natural and rustic for $7.99 they have the oil for $4.99 and this huge paddle style down here. You guys, you could probably fit like a turkey and a ham on here. It is huge. They also have this one. It's a little bit longer than the other one we just saw. And I didn't see a price on that one. They also have this very thick one with a nice well around the edge. Plenty of the little ones. This is just two. They kind of stuck together when I picked them up for $4.99. This I was very impressed with. So this has a nice little lip on it for your counter. And I think that would be a really handy thing to have especially if you don't have a great built-in cutting board in your kitchen that little lip will just help it sit right on your counter now cutting boards scream farmhouse but so do 
jars and they have such a large selection of glass jars that I was just blown away every size you can imagine these are super tall all the way down to these little squatty ones for $1.99 they have a little suction lid they have the small and then they do have a little bit larger for $5.99 and then a much taller narrow version so you could get the whole set or multiples of each this would be great with spaghetti in it or really anything $4.99 for the very large tall narrow version on that one and this was a fun little find a little set of canisters for $5.99 they also have this set of canisters for $8.99. You do get two. So one is a little bit smaller, fits right inside in a really nice oatmeal color. Lots of different sizes and styles. If you are thinking about redoing maybe your pantry, might be worth a little day trip into Ikea. They always have these three tier trays. I believe they run $29.99. This one was just used for display and I had to show it. They do have out a lot of new bakeware I have not seen. Of course, I only make it out this way about twice a year. Here is another really cute farmhouse find. They have sets of two beautiful tea towels or hand towels or dish towels way more of a tea towel fabric and they are very large they have them in the green set as well as a blue with the little ticking stripe and then a thicker stripe and for $3.99 you can't beat the price you guys we saw these at Target as part of the Joanna Gaines collection and they are just as fragile and beautiful and they're only $2.99 here at Ikea also tons of different kitchen linens from placemats to tablecloths aprons oven mitts and there's definitely a country thread through them lots of blue they did put in a little bit of orange to this whole set and plenty of neutrals which make me happy from beige to gray now these are not necessarily neutral but they are adorable it's a set of tea towels and look at the fabric I just think it's a really cute combo the blue and beige you could buy those and easily make pillow covers here are some really nice tea towels with the red and then this one looks navy but it's actually black here are some of the coordinating pot holders lots of red and navy and black Another very farmhouse find are these petite towels for 79 cents with the red ticking. And look at these bowls. They have these really cute bowls with a scalloped edge around them, little snap on top in that jadeite green. Rolling pens as well over here. And these bowls do come in two different sizes. The larger is $9.99. Now let's go look at all the dishes and serveware. They really are playing up this farmhouse theme over here. Now simple white dishes definitely say farmhouse. But look at this. They have a two-cheer tray. It does spin, so it's a bit of a Lazy Susan, and it is in a real nice creamy white for $19.99. And they do have a 
cake platter with cloche for only $8.99. Really low price for that. You could always just buy it and use the top dome to display some things. I found these really beautiful glass dishes and the edge looks almost just like lace. Really, really a fan of those. They have a whole line of these really nice deep weld dishes. Remind me a lot of Corel. And look at these mugs. They're so cute. Tiny bit of hobnail detail there around the top. Now they are $1.99. I feel like that's a little bit high, but they do look a lot like milk glass. A great imitation for sure. They have lots of different printed dishes. This beautiful one in sort of a dark, dark navy or black with just a little hint of orange and the hobnail detail around the edge. They also have a lighter version in this blue scalloped edge. That one definitely reminds me of my Corel. I am a big fan of the larger dinner plates they have for $2.49. Beautiful edge on that, definitely a milk glass detail if you ask me. They also have this set of 18 pieces for $39.99 and the edge on it is just beautiful. I really love the shape on this dish. So 18 pieces, you're gonna get bowls, salad plates, dinner plates. Here's the breakdown for you. You get six pieces on each. Some really adorable little sets of bowls with polka dots, pink and green. And look at this whole wall. It's just covered in beautiful dishes this is another one of their sets of 18. This one has an orange and green look to it with a little bit of a print. And this is another farmhouse find for sure. A wooden pedestal. You can use this in your kitchen to display different things or put it near your sink with all your soaps on it. Here's a printed platter for $14.99 that coordinates with the last set of dishes. And I just had to share this beautiful blue plate. They do have plenty of plain, simple dishes, but they are also putting out a lot more prints right now. I love this little white creamer. It's just so cute for $4.99. You could use that in decor easily. Just put a few little flowers in it. Lots of different sisal runners and placemats. And I'm so glad they've gotten away from some of their crazy color combos in their table linens. Lots of neutral placemats and runners and tablecloths. This little striped check definitely reminds me of farmhouse it's a dark navy blue they have lots of tablecloths that are quite large for $12.99 really nice little detail on this one here and some lace napkins set of four for $5.99 also in the white cream color you guys I looked up and I just thought this was so beautiful so they do have the napkins and the tablecloth for $16.99 in the dark navy cobalt teapots now I don't have blue in my house but I would consider it because that print is so pretty in person here's some more simple placemats and now we're back over to the glassware and dishes. 
they have out some really nice, simple, clean lined pitchers and storage containers in glass. These are always popular in farmhouse decor and they only have them in the clear, but they're $2.99. Here is a really pretty blue pitcher. Sorry, the color on my camera is just not giving it justice. It coordinates with the glasses we saw towards the beginning and they're $4.99. As well, they have a large drink dispenser. Now the nozzle on this one kind of feels plasticky, kind of cheap but I do love the glass design on it with the etching and it's $19.99. They have the large carafes with the cork topper for $4.99. And now let's look at a few linens. So they are very big on duvet covers, although they do have this comforter and sham set that I think screams farmhouse. And I was really surprised by the amount of really simple and classic looking duvet covers. Tons in the cream color. Different prices depending on the print and size. I thought that these florals were beautiful. They have the larger and then more of a medium floral and then the smaller print and lots of ticking stripe. So this one is kind of a grayish khaki color, but they do have it in this really farmhouse blue ticking stripe. And you get one duvet and one sham for $19.99. They also have it in the grayish color. It's almost khaki. Here's a blue chambray, more stripes, This set is just beautiful. Now the $39.99 I believe is for the queen size and they do have this one for $29.99. I believe this is the twin. It definitely coordinates with this printed floral and look at this stripe and it's only $16.99 for the twin version duvet cover and a sham. This one coordinates so much with the comforter set we saw. And they even have a black and white buffalo check. Now we're gonna take a look at some of their textiles. I thought that this curtain panel was really a pretty print. Their curtains are quite long, so if you need some very long panels, check out Ikea. One of my favorite things to look at when I'm here are the pillow covers. So I love this for so many reasons. One being, I don't have a lot of space to save tons of different decorative pillows, but I do like to have different covers on hand for different seasons. And I think they did a really good job with pulling out so many neutrals these are so neutral, I just feel like they would fit in with most people's decor, especially if you do do the farmhouse look. And the other reason I always gravitate towards pillow covers over actual decorative pillows is that you can take them off and wash them. And with three kids in my home, it's a busy season of life and accidents happen, so I like to be able to take everything off and wash it. I do really like these larger version with the little ties on the side. Now the color's not quite showing up correctly, but this is a denim stripe with khaki, and this is one of their longer versions, so probably 10 by 20 inch. Lots of stripes, some denim. These larger Euro sham size would be a whole lot more anywhere else. 
this print they're currently clearancing out. I love the little ticking stripe and it's also on sale right now for 10. It's another one of their longer lumbar pillows. Didn't spend too much time in the rugs, but they do have sisal rugs and runners if you're interested. I always love looking at their shelf brackets. These are great. You can use them on the longer side or the shorter side for $6 each. And just a quick look at what I found new in the lighting department. Tons of Edison bulbs and these almost honeycomb looking light fixtures. Definite industrial or farmhouse look there. I think these are a staple. They're their galvanized tin buckets that you can buy to put all of their really cute plants in that they offer for $4.99. I definitely always take a look at their plants. Here is a new lantern that I noticed. They have it in a gray and a white finish for $7.99. And they even have their own version of cloches with different bases from metal to wood. They also have quite a few metal pitchers in different sizes, the larger being $14.99 and the smaller $9.99. Lastly, we'll take a look at a few things in the garden department that I definitely saw the farmhouse look in. A few planters and these metal buckets with the black detail along the rim. I thought those were so cute. I hope you guys enjoyed this little farmhouse adventure in Ikea. Thank you so much for coming shopping with me, and I'll see you all soon in the next video.